Greetings from Tokyo, my dear friends. This is Daisuke, and I hope all of you are having a very nice day today. I wanted to make a quick comment, if I may, about my latest video or videos where I had the great honor of discussing the film called The Emperor's Naked Army Marches On. This is the documentary from Japan, which is directed by the great artist Kazuo Hara. And I have tried my best to show to you my uh, admiration for this incredibly profound work. So uh, I, this is uh, another way for me to say that I really strongly recommend that you watch this film if you have the opportunity. Now I'm not sure right now as of this moment in time about its availability. You know there is a actually this film is available on this Facets video DVD uh, from the United States but I'm not sure as to this, this DVD releases current availability. I don't think it's OOP but I'm not sure. I do know also that the film is available, for instance, on a Japanese DVD, but I don't think that Japanese DVD has any English language support, but I, I really have to double check that. But this is all, however, hopefully going to be somewhat superfluous in terms of a discussion, uh, maybe a few months from now, because our good friends at the UK label Second Run, so Second Run, uh, according to their website, now you may know this already, Second Run is planning to release this film, The Emperor's Naked Army Marches On, on a new Blu-ray. And according to the website, that release is scheduled to take place later this year, 2019. So if that holds true, then we can expect the release to occur, hopefully, within the coming months, right? Because we are now at the end of August 2019, as of the time of this video. So that leaves September, October, November, December. There was no hard date indicated on the website, as far as I am aware. That might change. And if anyone out there ha has any specific information about any hard date, release date, with respect to the second run release of The Emperor's Naked Army Marches On, then I would really appreciate that information. I am a great admirer of second run and their releases. While I don't have all of their releases, I have quite a number of their Blu-rays, and the films are of a particular aspect of cinema, world cinema, that I have very little experience in. And so uh, the films that are available there, most of them, are uh, for me anyway just uh, wonders and delights and I'm learning something new uh, every time I experience a, a title from Second Run. So when I heard the news that Second Run was planning to release The Emperor's Naked Army Marches On, I was so happy and there was this real feeling of bliss. I was feeling quite uh, jubilant because the, the fact that such an important label was putting this out there on this Blu-ray was just uh, so thrilling. And also, this is news that will hopefully create the situation such that more people will be able to uh, watch this film. I don't think Second Run's Blu-rays are any way overly expensive. I mean, they aren't cheap necessarily, but I think their prices can be reasonable. And if you search hard enough, I'm sure you can find uh, bargains, uh, sales somewhere. Uh, so anyway, good luck with that. But uh, my point is that I think Second Run is a high, high quality label. It's really doing some excellent work. And to have the Emperor's Naked Army marches on as part of their catalog really makes me so happy. I don't know as of now, I don't know what the specific specs, uh, spec information is with respect to that particular release. I don't think there were any uh, supplemental features indicated on the website as far as I know. That could change. Uh, second Run usually has uh, very healthy uh, supplemental features on its releases and so 
it would be reasonable to assume that its upcoming planned release of this film will also include some batch of supplements, which will be very welcome. I would very much welcome that indeed. So, um, uh, but let's uh, keep our eyes uh, open for that. And if anyone has any information uh, between now and the end of the year, whenever this is going to be released, if anyone has any information about what kind of supplements might be included on the second run release of The Emperor's Naked Army Marches On, please let me know. I'm so curious. I think I'm going to get that because it's so... Uh, it, it, it's really w wonderful to see this kind of treatment and also if the supplemental information provides any kind of new new documentary or new interview I am always for that so uh, anything for this film anything for this film and, and what it stands for and what it it, it all means it, it, it's it, this is such a profound work that any kind of supplemental work on this film is, is always welcome so uh, bravo to second run and I can't wait to get more information about what might be included as part of the whole package of the release um, and let's see what, what else what else is it? oh yes so I think yes this is uh, again my uh, uh, my sort of plea, if you will, my uh, uh, my hope is, is that uh, some of you might consider getting that particular release when it comes, and hopefully it's going to be coming sooner rather than later. So let's keep our eyes peeled and let's keep them open to the second run website and any updates and news or information that might be had there again if you have any information about that please let us know I would really appreciate getting that information it's sometimes not so easy for me to keep up with all the different facets of of blu-ray uh, updates and details and so um, I I am not always up to speed with my own updated information so if you have any updated information yourself about the particular release from second run it would be great to uh, to hear that so I'd really appreciate all the help uh, with this because once again I really think the more people that see this film I think the the better because this is a real eye-opening stunner of a film and it's it I'm almost positive that it will just leave you breathless um, and it's not that long it's only about two hours so it's it's it's, uh, it's uh, a good healthy length but it's uh, not overly long so it's not like an overwhelming experience and it goes by so quickly and it just once it starts it just uh, it just envelops you with its charm, its pace, and its real thrust, and its ultimate objectives, which I think I tried to allude to in my earlier videos, are both fascinating and disturbing. So, once again, my friends, second run, let's keep a lookout for this, and let us uh, I encourage you to at least consider uh, purchasing that if you have the opportunity. Uh, also, I know that sometimes this film can be shown in theaters. I have never had the opportunity to see this in the theater, but uh, I know that some people, some of my friends, uh, I've heard it, over the recent months have been able to see this film, and, and so, in the movie theaters, and so... If the opportunity arises for you in your local theater, please, I urge you to take advantage of that and to watch this film uh, on the big screen. Uh, I, gosh, I would, wow, what I would give to be able to watch this film on the big screen. My goodness, that would be some experience indeed. Wow, wow. I can, wow. Just trying to imagine that, that experience. Wow. Oh man, I wish I would. Oh gosh, I wish I had that opportunity. But oh well. Um, uh, if it, the opportunity arises for you, then please, please, uh, please take advantage of it if you can. Okay, my friends, uh, that's it as far as this little video, this sort of addendum, if you will, to my earlier videos on the works of Kazuo Ohara. The next film that I want to talk about in the Kazuo Ohara film video series is the documentary called in English it's called a dedicated life so that that is one uh, that is a powerful work and so if you have the opportunity to watch a dedicated life uh, please do so I'm not sure when I'll be able to put the video up but 
it will be up hopefully soon. I, I want to get that out there uh, definitely by the end of the year uh, and hopefully sooner rather than later. And so I will to certainly work hard. And there are other films by Kazuo Hara that I do want to uh, speak to uh, prior to the year's end. Uh, I'm talking like this because it's already the end of August and then in I think next week it's going to be September so September October November December my goodness time flies does it not it's amazing how time flies before we know it we will already be in the year 2020 Wow Wow time flies when you're having fun so um, but uh, let's uh, just enjoy ourselves while we can um, seize the day um, and let's just enjoy our time uh, watching as many good movies as we can and um, being happy and healthy and well that's the most important thing with ourselves and our family and friends um, so I hope that is true for you and that you are also watching a lot of great movies. So my dear friends, my dear, dear friends, so thank you very much for your time. As always, it really means a lot. And until we meet again, my friends, cheers.